What's up, everybody? This is Rob Shack. So today, we are doing the Battle of Ise Nagashima. This is the second level in my Ranma Ramori tale in Samurai Warriors 1. So, it's a good game. Love it. Ranma is a good character. Samurai Warriors 1 is a great game. Um, and there's just the storyline. We won the Battle of Mino, but ultimately they lost the war, so we switched over to the Oda side. You know, classic stuff. Um, we're still along the trail where we're similar to Mitsuhide, but you'll all see there's a few differences here. This is where their tra their tails start to deviate. It'll be kind of obvious. So it's interesting for sure. To note how they begin to differ. So let me know in the comments if you see the differences because it's it's there. These start they're subtle in this level. Um, this level's fun though. I like it a lot. It's pretty pivotal. It's a pretty pivotal in the mission for sure. Uh, I'm gonna do the first version of this with it all passes. I'm just gonna pass every mission that I see, and then we'll go from there. Um, I, uh, as I've said on my channel, if you're new to the channel, what I do is I go through the levels, and if there's extra missions at the end, we do them in the next video. But we'll figure out what we gotta do. And we'll work on it together. Most of the time, it's just something simple like defeat a certain enemy or do something a certain way. But it gets kind of crazy with some of the missions. So that's why I'm here, hoping to make it easy for people who may still have that lingering one mission left that they haven't figured out. Um, some of them are actually pretty hard, and I had to relook up how to do them because I was like, I don't remember because it was something ridiculous. So it's pretty cool that they do that, that there's like, it basically makes your actions like they have consequences. So I'm pretty pumped for that. Um, my bodyguards again. I can just do that. Hideyoshi, go to the uh, I figure out which way. He goes, okay, he does go that way. So All others, protect the task force. Up here. So. Yeah, I, I very much like this game. Um, I'm going to go through and play through this level first with all the passes, and then I'll go through and talk about the uh, what you got to do to get this secret versions of all the levels and all the missions. So this is just a 100% mission guide where I go through and do everything the way it's supposed to be done to get a full completion of this game. That's my ultimate goal, is to actually finish the game fully. And it's pretty fun to actually do that. It's not um, an unenjoyable process because there's so much replayability to this game. But yeah, I'm gonna show y'all how to get all the missions. I'll eventually I'll work through all of the uh, secret weapons and items and all that. There's a lot of stuff to unlock in this game. So, yeah. Just gonna kinda help out Hideyoshi. Just standing here like a moron. Gotta move Hideyoshi, you're gonna get stuck in this little trap here. Let's go. Something is still here. Hideyoshi, what are you doing? Man? Obliterate them. So some minor AI humor there, but that's not too bad. So we'll keep moving through, keep trying to figure out how to unlock all the missions. If y'all been watching this playthrough for a while, it's been fun. It's been a lot of fun, and I really enjoyed it, and I hope y'all have enjoyed the videos. I try to not talk too much, but I also like to make it somewhat entertaining and not just have it be like a silent play replaying thing. You know, I want to like actually interact with everybody. So I try to balance both of those things out in these videos. So if it's annoying, let me know. I'm trying to balance it. So yeah. Um, I don't know if that gate was supposed to drop something for me, but I would expect nothing less of you. Must have been one of ours. Trying to like basically just run through all the pil the pilgrims slash peasants so that Hideyoshi can actually move because he he's pretty stubborn. Like he will just stand there and like try to fight every single last pilgrim. That he can. It's really annoying. He has a very important mission, and he like won't do it quickly, even though he's like 
you know, pressed for time and everything. Yeah, see, he'll just stand here and fight this one peasant with no help for no reason other than just to be annoying, so. Not very smart. I mean, he is smart. He just built a castle in one day, but he's not street smart. I'll say that. He doesn't have a lot of health, but that's because it's still early in the game. And everyone's scaled down. It's still early. I have a terrible weapon still, so that's why I think they do it. And I think that's a great idea. Did not mean to hit that. Oops. You get your boost up pretty quickly because there's a lot you can do. If fate is what prevents you from fearing death, then I shall sever that fate from your bodies. is the success you shall all perish in flames the eco army must be completely eliminated there's no point in resisting any further maybe it's time to ask nobunaga for forgiveness it can't be done. lord nobunaga we surrender i ask you to show mercy and spare the lives of my men surrender that it actually they don't even try to surrender wow this could get ugly i would expect nothing less of you He's actually a pretty, pretty weak general, too, so... Do not I'll make sure he doesn't die. Sure Enemy doesn't officer die. Eliminated. But, yeah, so we are... I'm just defeating the enemy commander. Did he actually... He did. He died. Continue well... Exceptional warrior. I mean, he is very, very weak. Enemy officer eliminated. It makes them, but it, it's fine. It makes them feel like they fought a little better. You know, you avenge the guy who took out, did the fire attack. It's, it's cool. It's cool. Yeah, this level always intrigues me because it's like, it's supposed to be, like. Nobunaga's side just destroying the pilgrims. But that doesn't that never happens on this level. We must find glory as well. Sorry for the hassle. I'm gonna run down to the escape route. There must be a better try to figure this out. I want to make sure that they don't get away. I don't know what happens if they get away. So I'm just going to run down here and make sure. Because one of them is running for it. And it says all of them, if they get defeated or are eliminated. So I don't know. Okay, so they just retreat. All right, well that's fine. I'll let one of them go. Three. 
you. Okay, so Mitsuhide leaves. Uh, the cannon guy got annihilated, and Hideyoshi got, like, completely destroyed, and that was hilarious. He got defeated in, like, two seconds. And he, like, I protected him. I don't think he lost many of his bodyguards. Like, I think he got hit a little bit, but he, he did not do a good job of living. It's pretty embarrassing, actually. Now for this last one. So one. Oh, I actually. Escape. Oh, you actually fail it if one of them gets away. That's interesting. Well, I'll be doing that again at some point because I want to. Well, I am going to because there's other missions too. But yeah, interesting stuff there. But thank you all for watching, and be sure to like, subscribe, and comment for more. And have a great day.